Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I decided that I changed my mind and I want to compare the Water Fresh Complexion Touch with the Water Fresh Tint. So we're gonna do a side-to-side -side comparison just in case you want to see how it looks on the skin and not just on my hand. I thought it would be a nice idea to do that video as well, just in case some of you would like to see that comparison as well. Practical how it is side to side, compare both foundations. Uh, this is a tint and this one is the new release from Chanel. They call it Complexion Touch. I think it's something between the Fet Water Fresh tint and the foundation, something in between. Uh, and I really, really enjoy both these products. So we're going to apply to that together and see what we think. And you can let me know which side you prefer as well. So let's start with the application. On the first side, I'm going to try the new Water Fresh Complexion Touch with micro droplet pigments that evens my skin tone, illuminates it, conceals it and hydrates it. It gives me a natural and beatable, healthy looking glow. It is composed with 60% of water and it also gives you three times more pigment for fuller coverage and flawless makeup look than the water fresh tint. Uh, it also contains antioxidant rich active ingredients, including jasmine extract uh, and also enriched with emollients, such as tamarind extract, known for its hydrating properties, and leaves the skin plumped and delivers a fresh complexion that appears well rested. Absolutely love the look of this new foundation from Chanel. It's absolutely stunning on the skin, great coverage, great fresh looking skin. And on the other side, I'm going to pair with a water fresh tint that has micro droplets pigments. It's a for a bare skin effect, natural and luminous, healthy glow looking skin. So this contains 75% of water uh, for eight hours of hydration for a complexion full of vitality, freshness. Uh, it has patented microfluid technology with visible encapsulated pigments that melt on contact with the skin for an incomparable bare skin effect and the most natural, healthy, glow looking skin. I love how it looks on my skin. It's very natural looking. It's very lightweight, very hydrating. I love, love the look. It's like a skin glass effect. It doesn't have any coverage, but I really love how it looks on my skin. It's for the days that I don't want to wear a lot of makeup and I absolutely love how my skin feels and looks with this beautiful tint. So guys, this is the how the water fresh tint looks and this is how the new complexion touch on this side. As you can see, you can still see a bit of my skin here while it's covered nicely on the other side. So what I'm going to do, do the rest of my makeup and then I'll come back and give you my final thoughts of these two applications here and see what you think as well. Uh, I would love to see your feedback as well. So let me pop the rest of my makeup and I'll come okay, back. Okay guys, I'm back. I've got all my makeup on, uh, just, uh, except for bronzer, I haven't put bronzer on. Just a little bit of the new blush on my cheeks and the new lipstick, the lip balm. Because it's peachy, I thought I will go with a peachy look today. So this is what it looks like. So this is the side with the new complex touch and this side is the water fresh tint. I think this side is a bit more luminous, a bit more glowy, but you can definitely see my skin through, especially here on this area. You can see my pores a bit more than this side. This is more blurred because I was discovered all my imperfections. So I think on this side, also, although I do, I do love the look, uh, it definitely not, doesn't give you the coverage that the complex touch gives you. I think it covers beautifully on this side. But as I can see here, my you can see my pores while well, here is more poreless because it covered the, the pores nicely. But I still like the water fresh tint. I think it looks so beautiful, so healthy looking, natural looking. So I really love this side. I also, also love the new complex touch with a bit of um, coverage on top of what it is. This is already. So I think how I, I place this on the Chanel foundations is between the water fresh tint and the foundations so or something in between. So I love that because it has the freshness uh, and also the how the foundation, the consistency of the foundation and of the water fresh mixed together, I think. So it has a bit of both, a bit of coverage, a bit of this luminous, fresh looking uh, skin. So I really, really loving both of them. 
You can let me know down in the comment section which side you prefer. So this is the Waterfresh Thin, I'll come a bit closer. And this is the new Complexion Touch. I think they both look beautiful. So highly recommend both of them. If you try this one and you want a bit of more coverage, go for the new one. You're gonna enjoy this, it has a bit of more coverage, but has that beautiful, luminous, fresh, natural looking skin. Uh, and provides a bit of coverage, so it's perfect for summertime. Love both of them. Uh, so that was the video today, guys. I hope you enjoy. If you did, give me a big thumbs up. Let me know which side you prefer more. And I'll see you in my next video. Make sure you subscribe. Bye-bye, guys.